and welcome back. You're watching continuing coverage of the World Healthcare Congress in Washington, D.C. And tonight we kicked off the event with our inaugural Health Value Awards presentation. And I'm so pleased to have with me one of the winners of this year's awards. Uh, Patrick Harvey is with CHG Healthcare. And Patrick, it's, it's really a lovely award that we have sitting in front of us. Uh, what category did you win it in? So we won, we won for the midsize employer category. Okay, and what is happening at CHG that really helped you stand out? Yeah, so I think the, the one thing in particular that, that I think really made us stand out was the work that we're doing with a company called Vivio Health. And so um, what we're doing with them, they're a, a vendor that specializes in the specialty drug space. And so we came to a realization about a year and a half ago that uh, specialty drugs were an area for us specifically that could get out of hand in terms of cost pretty quickly. And so we started trying to, to look for solutions and, and Vivio Health was the solution that we came up with and it's been incredibly successful so far. And so since you have that case study, is this something that you show or talk about with other clients? Yeah, yeah. So we, um, you know, we're obviously always happy to be kind of a, a spokesperson, so to speak, with, with Vivio, just because they've done a really, really good job for us um, in, in doing kind of two things. The, the two things that are really, really important for us with our team and kind of what we're trying to accomplish is we're trying to obviously control cost but we're also trying to do so without um, sacrificing the employee experience. That's really important to us is maintaining that, that high level of experience that we have kind of come to expect at our company. And so um, we're just really grateful to have found a partner that's allowed us to do both and do so successfully. Do you believe that in today's marketplace, validation is becoming increasingly more important and, and looked at? I mean, in the past, um, patients might just assume that they're getting good care yeah. from someone, from a good yeah. hospital or from a good provider. Right. But is that changing? I, th I, I believe so. Um, and I don't know if it's beca just because people are a little more skeptical maybe than they have been in the past. But, um, you know, for us, what's nice about our company is we have a really high trust index with our employees and our employees trust one another. So having that validation for maybe somebody that's participated in the program has also made a huge difference for us. Okay, and going forward, how will you use this win to do business in the future? Yeah, so I think for, for us, um, you know, it's it's just, again, going back to validation, it's kind of validation that, uh, you know, it's okay to, to kind of take chances and kind of think outside the box with some of the things that we're struggling with. And mm -hmm. so I think that's the main lesson that we'll, we'll take from this and, and implement moving forward. All right, Patrick Harvey, thank you so much today welcome, for thank your you. time and uh, congratulations. Thank you. And I'm Mabel Jong. Thanks for watching.